here we go. We're finally gonna, or I'm finally gonna jump into Red Dead. Everyone else, like the entire world, has been playing this for days now, but I'm a little late to the the scene. Hey, look, that's a that's a it's a cowboy. I've done my best not to uh, spoil myself in this game, so I don't really know much other than we start in some cold places. Uh, hello, Snuffle. Welcome. How's it going? Is this the whole game? I mean, it's pretty cool. Nice, nice screens here. That is a beautiful campsite. Well, I will let you know, Darth, in this stream, if this is good or not. I'm assuming it. Is that by 1899? The Age of the Outlaws and Gunslingers was at an end. Hmm. Indeed, lady. Indeed. Hey, Rose. How's it going? Oh, boo. America becoming a land of laws. Oh, those, those poor lawless gangs. Oh, Rockstar made them. Oh, okay. No evil That's will true. taint the hey, lands what up, so? bequeathed unto me. Haven't seen you for a bit. Although, I've also been away for a bit. Thank you for the resub for 10 months, Fallen. Thank you. Welcome to the stream. We're being cowboys. Gonna try to be cowboys. Oh no, is this like the Skyrim opening? We're in wagons. It's gonna take like 10 minutes. We're gonna need to install a mod to skip the opening. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh, if we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. It's weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he... You know... An old man in town. Bandit. It ain't far. What, while he dies? No. Come on! Yeah! Indeed, Boo. They have curved swords. Curved. The start of this game is slow. Yeah, I heard the first couple hours are kind of just like a tutorial. Chapter one. You're a cowboy. Also, as a heads up, it just started to storm really hard outside. Perfect timing. So if my power gets cut out, because that happens in storms, um, that's why the stream stops. Just to let you know. This is on PS4. Not a pro, though. This is a normal PS4. It's a Destiny PS4, so it's all, you know, white and, I guess... That's it, really. They didn't put any Destiny decals on the Destiny PS4. Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Whoa, I like your hair. Davy's dead. There was God dang. nothing more you could have done. God damn it, Davy. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. They put the First gold or the coin over here, the eyes? And you were gonna get yourself warm. I sent 
John and Mike are scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out. See if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davey, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be dead. We're going to be long gone. Oh, well, yeah, dead. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. So we have... Well, we have a child in the game? Yeah. So, they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. Me. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son! Uh, we need you strong. Okay. Looks pretty. Also, I think the game was out for like maybe 10 minutes until Twitter. Um, I saw an upload of someone who drew a penis in the snow. So, I'm glad humanity is still on track. No joke, it was out for like 10 minutes. And already Twitter had pictures like that. Weird that you have to constantly tap your um, button to ride faster. Yeah. Can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. Okay. The only one I can rely on to stay strong. You are the player right character, man. Wait, is that someone coming towards us? You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Oh, damn, it's Micah. I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. It sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Oh, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. Ah, oh, little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. Hello, Lena. Hello, Picard. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. 
Right. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Oh, wait, 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 what was that? I didn't see it. I didn't even press a button. What was it? Double tap? I saw a double tap X. You run into anybody else? I, I reckon we're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. Yeah, well, don't talk to me about crazy. Oh, so no, glad you're all right. I was worried, Micah. It's all gonna work out, Morgan. Is it, Morgan? We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. Ain't much. Shelter. So, okay. Oh, okay. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Are we going to murder these people? I mean, we are outlaws. Okay. Let's head down there. I really don't know what that double X thing was. Maybe that was Gallop? That seems to be maybe Gallop? I don't know. <laughs> Let's hitch up here. Nice reference, Picard. Very far to like it. The Lord says he can get me out of this one. But he's pretty sure. You're fucked. Nah. -huh. And this is like weird laugh. Hey Alyssa, how's it going? Let me do the talk. We don't want to scare these folks. Oh, I want to shoot these folk. Actually, how should we play the outlaw? I'm kinda on the fence. I, I could play him. I get as an actual really Someone's evil dude. I can play him as a Han Solo. I can play him as Good Two Shoes. I can play him as like a, a crazy psycho. Oh, probably not. Maybe not crazy psycho. Nasty looking degenerates. Micah, hide behind that wagon. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of you. Go to the shed and press L one to take cover. What this outhouse? Take cover in that shed over there. Oh, I see the mini map. Oh, okay. Can we? Can there we go? Get in position. Come on. Well, it has been a while, Whoa. Alyssa. Shut up, Billy. Excuse me. Hello. Oh, well. hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. Hey, thank you for the... Folks, Jay Wing, thank you. Parker, we got a problem. <laughs> There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur. need some... There's a body in the wagon. I hear you. Just and keep your eyes on Dutch. I think you should. Uh, I am feeling better, Jay Wing. Thank you for asking. Sorry, I'm just trying to pay attention to the game and stuff. Um, okay. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Please, I am. <laughs> oh, no. Headshot. Whoa, oh, oh, oh. no, 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 no. Get back in cover. Oh, shit. I shot off his hat. Which was on a PC so I could actually use a mouse. Oh, I ran the wrong way. Whoops. I said I'd handle this. Didn't seem to be going too well. Goddamn O'Trisco boys here. Why? I don't know. Maybe same reason as us. 
Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Uh, but you want me to play as a Han Solo? I mean, I can do that. Matoko Kusanaki from Gits? I don't know which one that is. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. Get Chewbacca. Medicine. Whiskey. Hold uh, square in your items to pick them up while searching the house. Okay. That was a beautiful uh, piece of salted beef right there. O'Driscoll's. I don't believe it. That's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree. Oh, of course. Yeah, the major and ghost in the shot. Right, right, right. Uh, I should have known that one. Starving. Your health care drains over time and now empty. While empty, you will experience negative back. effects. Okay, open up the satchel. Okay. Different items with different effects. Eating food will refill your health core. Better quality food will refill more core. It's important to uh, keep on top of your core. I don't really want us to split up. Big old pool of blood on the floor here. I saw it. Probably the poor bastard who lived here. Micah found a dead body in the wagon outside. Now, isn't there some kind of like Batman vision in this game? I'm going to start packing the horses. You keep looking. Grab anything you think we can use, then meet me out here. All right, buddy. But I know I've heard that this game does have some kind of Batman vision. Maybe just not unlocked yet. Hmm. Poor bastard was married to. That poor bastard. Well, won't be needing the corn purse anymore. 98 whole cents. Wow. Well, we can retire. There is cow vision. It lets you find milk. That's handy. Mr. Sarcastic. Okay. I mean, our health, I think, is a kind of low. Nope. No, we just have. That's all. Okay. Nope. That was a total waste. Whoops. Premium cigarettes. Slightly damages stamina core. Slightly restores dead eye core. Oh, let's just keep eating these. Hell yeah. Anything else I'm missing? You saw the blood. Maybe over here? Oh, some classic oat cakes. Now we're talking. Alright. Come on, Arthur! How much is 98 cents in these times? Um, I think it's uh, 98 cents in these times. <laughs> Micah, you search the cabin. I'm just messing with you. Uh, it was it's a lot more than what it is today. 98 cents is probably a fair sum. Uh, hello, Rainbow. Welcome. Thank you for the host. Oh shit! Oh, uh, okay. What's going on? Just me. What's going on? Did he now? Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here. 
and where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Follow me, and we will punish this yes. darkness. Uh, with are the others at an old mining camp southwest of here. Hello, Faye. Welcome. Near the lake. Hello, Kenobi. Hello, Shigarame. Welcome. Also, thank you for the sub, Snuffle. Thank you. No. What are you bastards doing? Thank you for your generosity. Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> are you sure you don't know more? It looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. Are you sure? When you're done. Are you sure? Choke? Holy crap. I don't know anything else. <laughs> That's probably better than choking him. That seems a bit too much. Pick up my hat? <laughs> Alright. Hello, Karak. Hey, what up, Cherry? How's it going? Calm down, buddy. Oh, here we go. Gonna pat the horse. Yeah, okay, boy. Horse bonding. Continue to bond with your horse increases its trust in you and improves its attributes. Are I? I'm not going to um, shoot the horses. Why would I do that? I love horses. Well, I like horses. I have no problem with horses. I should say. I can't say I love them. He's dealt with. Good. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Get that horse hitch. Don't want him bolting. Four legged protein? Oh man. No, no, no. We're not going to eat the horse. Get away from me! What the fuck? My God, what the hell do you think you're doing? Hey, thank you, Dr. Sepseb. Thank you for the miss. Come on. You know what I mean? Come on. 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 We need to get out of here, and quick! Come on, now. Oh. 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 You okay, miss? They came three days ago. They lost me. They... Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. I thought we were going to have to put down Micah for being a, uh, a very bad person. Yes, it's okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. <laughs> it's okay. We're... Don't worry, miss. We're you bad know, men. We'll keep you safe I... until you figure out hmm. what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Maybe don't. Adler. Adler. Maybe don't say that we're bad men. Sadie Adler. Mrs. He... He was my husband. Hey! Somebody's coming! Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back! How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, hey, hello, Red Moon. We found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found... Some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. And this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink of something. 
And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. I'm... They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Oh, Micah. You're going to be that kind of character, huh? Do you want a petition to name the horse Roach? I'm down with that, sure. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I'm sorry, I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. Mm -hmm. I know... The situation were reversed. And he'd look for me. Thank all you. Alright. Let's get to know Javier. This way. Hello, Bob. I am I feeling better, thank you. John was headed up the river. For all we know... He kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Ah, uh, yes, this is a prequel. Ex exactly. This is, um... What, like, 11 or 12 years before the first game? I know that the MC from the main game is in this game because he was a part of this gang. So I think we'll probably see him at some point in this game. Uh, Mar Marston? John Marston, right? Make yeah, a horse a shaped smoke. snow angel? What? Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, it seems somebody left. Who are we playing as? Recently. Um, Arthur? And that way. Sure, well, come on then. Uh, a man that's in the same gang as John Marston was. There's some tracks leading to the river. Whoa. Oh, let me inspect this. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. Not that way. Nope, Rose. Nope, nope. Ah. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So are... So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. We're not calling the horse dinner. Crisis. Dutch oh. killed a girl in a oh. bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. <laughs> we continue along the cliff wall here. Whoa. Rear view. He got shot. Mac and John both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. Listen, Rose and Alyssa, I'm not making that on a stream. <laughs> Bad business, all right. The tracks lead this way, Arthur. Hey, 
that snow's coming in hot again. Oh, cool. This has a cinematic camera you can just pop on anytime. Huh? That reminds me of uh, Star Wars Empire War? Right? The RTS game where you can enter a cinematic mode and just watch all the ships. That's kind of cool. Huh. I am still controlling him. Watch out. Sorry, Javier. I'm getting used to this camera. Interesting. Careful, it's getting narrow here. Come on, boy. I am sure that was on accident, though. Of course, struggling. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow. I don't usually in I don't know about this, intentionally I'll make penises, penis shapes, and games. Now let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there, boy. Come on now. Hey, look. Over there. You see that? See what? Yeah. John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on, up there. Hey, what up, Sheridan? Thank you for the host, Dilu. How's it going, man? Apparently, the horse balls are shrunk in the winter in this game. Can you fact check? Oh, my God. Um, I, I guess, yep, there, there are some balls down there, I believe. I grabbed that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? There we go. Fact check. There we go. Small, small horse testicles. There you go, Sheridan. You can only carry one side on at a time. You can swap your carried weapons with a horse. Horse weapons. Oops. Down this way. You're welcome, Sheridan. Good to know, Picard. Good to know. Hello, Sir uh, Susaski. Watch out here. You sure about this? Yeah, pretty sure. It's coming from this way. Okay. Me out of that we're high up here. You're telling me. Oh man. Drops down here. Watch yourself. Be careful. Stay low under here. Okay, from here. Watch your step. It's real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. Man, this would be really scary. Closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. Thank you, Alu. It is very slippery. Can I fall off the side of the cliff? For science? Sure. Let's see how the checkpoints are. Way. 
Okay. Watch out here. Rose, you accidentally banned the wrong person. Oh my goodness. Mierda, that we're high up here. You're telling me. There's a drop here. <laughs> it sucks when you try to ban someone and the chat moves on you, so you ban the wrong person. Watch your head here. Okay, from here. Watch your stamp. It's real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Hey, friends, it's really slippery through. We're coming. Closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. Damn, it's cold. How you doing? I'm miserable. Been a tough few days. I know. Here, take a drink of that. Thanks. Oh, we're gonna get drunk. Not designed for this snow. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, where are you? John. John. Wait, what was the name of that kid in Dead? Was it Dead Rain or Falling Rain or whatever? Um, because there's a part of that game where you were the dad and you just walk around calling his name over and over again. John, you there? What was his name? That's John. Billy? I don't think it was Sean. Yeah, I think it was Sean. John. Sean. Heavy Rain. Thank you, Rose. Yes, not Dead Rain. Jason? Was it Jason? Actually, it may have been Jason. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. Oh, John! It's fucking Marston. Oh, my God. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. What up, John? <clears throat> I know your son. I'm freezing. <clears throat> Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. It was both. He had two sons. Oh, thank you, Robin. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See? <laughs> it's weird hearing John again. You weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. I like John in the first game. From what I remember. I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Look up there. Oh no, it's more outlaws. Wolf laws. Damn wolf laws. Okay, here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. All right, wolves. Oh, we're on an escort mission already. <laughs> We're getting you out of here. Keep them away from us. Hey there. Stay back. <laughs> Jesus. I'm sorry. Let me skin you. Okay, I can't.
Listen, I didn't want to kill the pups. The game forced me. Come on then. Let's get back to the others. Yeah. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. Oh, you'll be fine, John. You can't die yet. Like a, a dog bite. <sighs> nope. Little fella got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Not gonna punch my horse, Sheridan. I've seen the gifts. Everyone's like, oh, I accidentally punched my horse. Here's the gift. Some aggressive fucking wolves. I'm out of ammo. There we go. Oh god. You see any more, Arthur? Don't think so. Jesus. You still with us, Marston? Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now. Cinematic. You should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. A minute. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Come on! Someone help John down off this horse. We get some help here. I guess you could play like the entire we game in cinematic help. mode. That'd be kind of get interesting. Some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Oh, here we go. There we go. Ah, you careful, idiotas. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> We've been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Oh, we have a journal. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. You know, I tried to keep a journal once. I wrote it in like tw two times. We get strong, we get warm. And I was like, this is dumb. We wait. When the storm breaks, we move. But we're safe here. Oh God. Warm enough. I guess. We've been running for weeks. I mean, running. Oh, you that's, that's just doubtful. what we just said, isn't it? Not doubtful, just worried. All right, anyway. We have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. I hope not. We had a bit of bad luck, but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait. Must be 90 degrees there? What, what do you mean, Rose? Water and we get our money, or we get some more. Oh, we can sit? And we keep heading west. But we're heading east. All right, GG, friends. For now. Not getting back up. For now. We got this. That's it. We're safe. 
Soak, don't get yourself. It's a diary. I feel like that was a joke I missed. Cheery, I'm sorry. You kept the diary until your mom read it, Elena? Alright, alright. I mean, diaries are supposed to be private. Your wife still keeps one, Alyssa? Okay. It works for some people. Not for me, though. Hey, hello, hybrid. Welcome. Help with you, boys, because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lamb, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess... I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> I'm with him. <laughs> a party. <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. That funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You, you always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Colm always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. Well, I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson, would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscolls about. Yeah! Yeah, I think Micah will be a problem. I agree. Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score of their planet. I did not enter a cinematic mode. Is quite a few of them. Is this the digital version? Uh, yeah. As I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, the people you love will die. Alright. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. Mm. That's how this will end. Damn right, boss. Some bad blood. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. I'm trying to access the horse inventory, but I guess you can't do that unless you're off the horse? Unless I forgot right, the gentlemen. button. 
This is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, ready Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go. I'm just enjoying the um, snow deformation. Oh, how do I get off the horse? Uh, nope, nope. Yeah, we got this covered, Arthur. Go with Dutch. <laughs> How do I get off the horse? I forget. I thought you were going with Dutch. I'm trying. There we go. I need the uh the inventory, the horse inventory. It's not popping up. Okay, well. Oh my god, Picard. There they are. That's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Oh, I'm moving this. Oh, okay. I thought this was like a cutscene. That, yes, that horse is very pretty and is holding my stuff hostage, indeed. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. <laughs> they leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get them? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. Hey, thank you, Sheridan, for gifting us up to Picard. And much less fun to rob him and his score. Thank you for the support, Sheridan. Out about it. All right. Let's go pay our old friends a visit. The alerts are really loud, are they? Oh, um, okay, let me turn it down then. Don't forget to grab there we go. From your horse. Weapons not set in your loadout before dismounting will remain in your horse. Keep us you got it, oh, Josh. this is why it wouldn't let me touch the inventory, because it was waiting for me to do this, all right. Oh, gosh darn it. Long arm shoulder. Okay. Lantern or I guess the hunting knife? Then we got a lasso? Oh man, we gotta lasso somebody to like a train track, right? That's just that's just Good. gotta be. On, let's go. We'll circle around the far side and go down that way, same as Mike and Bill. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur, Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Yes. Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including calm and wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now come on. Last with somebody while on a horse and drag him to a promised land? <laughs> Don't worry, friend. We going to the promised land. Thank you for the pun there, Sheridan. And Boo. How long did it take me to download this game? Hmm... I think it was like 30 minutes to an hour. Oh, wow. 
Watch out. This bit's steep. Uh, Cheery, Rose and Sheridan have a special relationship. That relationship is Sheridan provokes Rose by doing puns, and Rose bans him. Does anyone know if a physical copy comes with a map? I do not. Um, I'm sure they would list that, like, on their website. They're like, buy the Super Ultra Cowboy Edition. It comes with your very own cowboy from the 1800s. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running... Hush. Let's just get down there first. All right, buddy. Down through these trees, quick. Hey, anybody see me? Think they went hunting with the others. Spot on the fix is meant to be on guard duty. Got ourselves a trusted rifle. Let's see how this plays in first person. Stay low. Come on, follow me. Okay, let's get in cover. Oh man, Mike is already down here. So what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. So we got everything we need. We have to move on this right now. Okay, fine. You make the move. All right. On me. Oh damn. Oh, get shot in the face! Alright, enough with the, uh, oh. With that mode. Although in first person, it, it's, it, it's kind of cool, I guess, but... Headshot. Oh, and he falls down. Uh, so this game has lock on, like heavy lock on. When you first hit the um, aim button, it just locks you center mass to the lo uh, closest target. So it, this it seems to be very beneficial. Of um, like, don't hold in the lo the uh, lock on. Just keep tapping it. I think that's all of them. Search the bodies. Strip everything we can from them. Ah! Do you recognize any of that? Damn it, old Driscoll's! God damn it. All right. Hey, Darcyl, thank you for subscribing no. to the channel. If you can shoot a gun and ride a thank horse you for the support. and kill without thought, you're in. Think how long some of you have been with me. I am it's a tap triangle, right? Half the names of these fools. There we go. We need everything we can so basically it's a name bot? Yeah. That probably is, is a good thing for a console shooter like this, where people are moving around. I think that's probably a good call. Heads up, boys. We got more I'm not done looting yet, though, boss. Oh, well. Dude, look at all these corpses, man, on the mini-map. Holy crap, we really killed a lot. All right, you guys... Uh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. The gun. Get, get the gun out. This one. Is there? 
Advance! Dead Oh God! Reload. Reload. Looting all these dead bodies. Let's skin the corpses. My God, man. I. <laughs> I never really realized how many there were until you see all these X's on the map, my god. How did like three, four people hold off all of these? Good thing I got the power of the MC behind me. Now all I need is my harem. That's what happens in these, right? All main characters get har harems. Hey, welcome back, Nico. Maybe I'm an AI, Sheridan? Maybe. I can neither confirm nor deny these allegations against me. Oh, harems only happen in, in anime, not video games? Aw. Oh. Well, clearly I'm doing the wrong thing. I want to act all awkward about uh, around a bunch of uh, hot ladies as they all, for some unknown reason, want to get with me. And go into situations where like, oh no, this girl is in a towel barely covering anything. Oh no, I saw her legs and she smacks me in the face. And it's funny. We don't have time to mess around. Yeah, we do, Dutch. Shut up, I'm looting. Isn't that me, IRL? No. I just always hate how, like, all the guys uh, in those animes are just... They're either clueless, even though people are so obvious in their advances, or they're just like, Oh no, girls like me! All of these very attractive... Like one <laughs> a single type of girl likes me. This lolly likes me, or this very mature lady likes me. Oh no, what am I gonna do? All right, what the hell do we know? Good work, boys. Now let's tear this place apart. <clears throat> Bill. Go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the Hello, lab. Wolf. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. So we're going to rob a train then? Is that what this is going Oh, I see Faye. Got it. Plans. 
Huh, I wonder if there's dynamite in here. Hey. Oh, hey, look! This looks good. It's dynamite. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. Smells good. Come on. Did we get everything? Think so, boss? Did he say the dynamite I'm smells one good? Of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. All right. Let's get out of here. Proud of you, boys. All of you. Not a man down. Look out! Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pummel us hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. For life. Wait until we have John, Mac, Tor Dog Pound. On back right with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed, we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. You think they all sound the same, Rose? I can hear the differences in the voices. At least with Dutch and uh, Arthur here. Hey, buddy. Oh, is this the lasso part? Hold L2 to ready the lasso and aim at O'Driscoll. Okay. Hey, what up, buddy? Shut 
I'm lawful good? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 100% we are lawful good. I don't know nothing real about them. Honest. Oh, I think I'm gonna puke. Please, I'll do anything. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay, okay. That's two bones right there. Uh, hello, Beefy. No, this is a normal PS4, not a pro. Here we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. Oh man, this guy's going to have a rough don't day. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle! Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! Ah! I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. What if he's telling the okay. truth, though? What if he really isn't an O'Driscoll? <laughs> We're about to beat the shit out of him for no reason. Oh, well. Not our problem. Let me get the shotgun out. Uh, wait, what? Ah, oh, I see. So we can stow away a bunch of stuff on our horse. But where's the uh, weapon thing? That's what I want. Because I want to get the shotgun out. Hmm. Oh, well. Can you romance the campfire? I don't think so. We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what, 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pierce. We were stranded at sea. 50 days and you unfortunately survived when we ran away from Blackwater I wasn't able to get supplies in well when government agents are hunting you down sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short we'll survive we always have and if needs be we can eat you you're the fattest I sent Lenny and Bill hunting and they found nothing well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. I mean, I know there were some wolves out there. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if there's game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. <coughs> this outfit kind of reminds me of like a look for um, like a cav person yeah. in the military. You take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun. 
and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. Oh, cool, we get bows? Right. Let's head out. So we can throw them bows? <laughs> I don't think anyone says that phrase anymore, though. Hey, a horse bonding. Are you holding up, Charles? Hold R1 and tap. I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Woo! Look at that! Bad. We're bonding so well. I just can't pull a bow right now. Uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill? It ain't no Driscoll. Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. You know what time it is? Time for that smooth cinematic. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. <sighs> Been a wild few days, all right. That right north from Blackwater. So cinematic. Stuck in the storm, going out for John. That thing with the old Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that. Just. A lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. I agree, Faye. I, I think this game looks really good. And all we've seen so far is just a bunch of snow. So if you're wondering, I'm manually shifting the cinematic angles here and there. Wait, oh, this is just actually a cinematic. <laughs> I think, because it wasn't letting me shift angles anymore. Yep. I'll, just as I start talking about how I'm manually doing the cinematic changes, and that's not automatic, the game actually goes to a damn cinematic mode, so I can't, can't actually do it. There we go. So yeah, this is me. The game doesn't auto-cycle through these. It doesn't seem like you have to continuously pr well actually There's some patches of grass here. oh no this is the cinematic again oh wait no it's not I don't know don't listen to me I'm crazy the winds died down too that's good no wind at all is bad but if it's too strong they won't move now shh stay quiet Stop here a second. I see something. Okay. I'm gonna pat that horse. Has a deer been here? Oh, good horse. Recently. How can you tell? How can you not? Let's walk it from here. Wait, do I have a? Oh, I don't have a bow. Wait, the horse just pooped? Oh, I'm, I must have missed it. I don't think so. Maybe not. Focus. Oh, there we go. Eagle eye. Ooh. So we're tracking the animal. Once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. So I'm assuming that there's going to be some kind of... Well, something must happen when the tracking bar fills up, right? Oh, it probably tells us what animal this is. Maybe. It may be hard to see on the stream, but there is a very light highlighting going on where the tracks are. It's like pulsating. It's white on white, though, so it may be hard to pick up on the stream. I'm not sure. Because it's kind of hard to pick up in the game. 
Enable the eagle eye and focus on the trap. Oh, oh, that's just how long your vision is. Okay. Got it. Oh, shit. Your scent is also shown in the eagle eye blowing in the direction of the wind. Animals will flee if they smell your scent. So remain downwind. Hey, thank you, Wolfus, for the... Wah! Thank you for the support. So where's my, um, scent? Because this is just showing me the tracks. I'm not seeing any scent coming off of me, though. Shh. Down there. You see him? Yeah, I see him. Are you ready with that bow? Yeah, I'm ready. The further you draw the string back, the more damage your arrow will inflict. Holding it too long will reset your aim. Attract an animal's attention by selecting call while aiming at it. This will give you a chance of a clean kill as they raise their head before fleeing. Interesting. Where's this other deer? Oh, there's another track that keeps going, okay. Um, I guess we can't skin the animals yet. Oh, 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 oh. Alright, we get it this time. Got it. Well done. I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. Alright, buddy. Sure your hands okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Sorry, dear. But we oh my god, we are strong. That <laughs> All right. Uh, Roach. Oh, there you are, buddy. But yeah, like, holy crap, how strong this dude has to be to just lift a carcass like that so easily? My god, just dead weight like this? Jesus. Pretty good hunt there, boy. Okay, boy. When you are. Come on, then. Let's head back. Can we, um, ride faster? Nice work, Arthur. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. Yeah, it's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> I've seen enough of that. How things were looking a couple you know what time back. it is? Smooth well, cinematic. On the turn. 
Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak. And you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? Still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. What the? I'm trying to change camera angles. There we go. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding Neil Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, and everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big game. Oh, that's a, that's a burr. Watch out. Bear up ahead. No, it's a burr, buddy. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Well, he's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. But he's got a lot of meat on him, though. It, I'm sure it's a happy burr. We can tame the burr. I learned that in Assassin's Creed Odyssey. You can tame animals. Cut up here. Off the trail. You're fine, it's just a burr. We ain't ever talked that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. I like this guy. How long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. He taught me to read. John, too. He taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. The Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. So he's been with Dutch for 20 years. My God. How's that new horse? He's all right. He 
He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. <laughs> I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. I can see what they mean by this is a very slow game, but I like it so far. Some food back, boys. Probably because there's a lot of conversation. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Uh, thank you for showing me how to use the boat properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Sorry, dear. Well, well, well. <sighs> Just drop it down in. What a surprise. I found a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. <laughs> he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now, shoot, get lost. <sighs> well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. Go <laughs> rest that hand, Charles. I like this Arthur guy. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skinned that one that you dumped on the floor there. Did you herd cattle in the first game, Rose? I don't remember that. Oh, Jesus. I... I don't think it's quite huh. that easy, but... Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. Okay. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> Guess we don't really need a freezer to put it in, huh? <laughs> you listened to a nice lady for an hour as you herded cattle in that game? Wow, yeah, I guess I blocked it from my mind. It's been a bad few weeks. But Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans and... Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Who the hell is Leviticus Cornwall? Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here then? You have a oh, Reverend yeah. in the uh, game? And you'll pay me. But for the moment, you just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. Want me to come? Of course I do, but... Look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway men. Bill! Hello, Jargus. Ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower. 
Just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Oh, we, we about to rob a train, friends. Breaking, we could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. We gonna be a real outlaw. What do you want from me, Jose? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Jose. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we has in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? Who and is? Railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. Well done, Picard. Yes, we are about to ro rob a Shania Twain. Exactly. Also, wow, Shania Twain. I've not heard that name in years. The hell, Picard. Oh no, Cheery, you're you're jumping on the Sheridan train. Dutch likes talking so much, he's always a bit hoarse. Oh boy. Okay, gentlemen. Listen up. All of you. According oh to boy. the information so kindly provided to us by the Odrisses, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're going to pick it off after it crosses the border Sorry. with the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan Bray. Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move past. This music, Is everyone though. Everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep. I am not because I was reading chat when he told me what I was supposed Let's to do. Try. Oh, sorry, Cheer. I thought you were going for a pun. I really, I legit don't know what I'm supposed to be doing because I was, I was reading chat. I assume I follow Dutch. Sounds, sounds good, Elu. I would just shoot everything. Like Han Solo does. Out of the snow, finally. Feels good, doesn't it? But we need to get this done fast. Thank you, Rose. <laughs> before anyone gets up here after us. Oh, look at you boys. See? This is what I call a crew. Micah Bell. Charles Smith. Arthur Morgan. Javier Escuela. And what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his horse. <laughs> Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Not again. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back, and that's the end of it. The money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money, once we work out how to cash them. Now everyone, shut up! Get your mind on the job at hand. My mind's on it, Dutch. There's the water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Whoa there. Oh? Is Bill there? Yeah. 
You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Sure. I'll check on Bill. Getting on. Yeah. yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? Yeah. All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Okay. Outlaw stuff. I think two people are going to die, Darth? Okay. I think that's fair to lose at least somebody in this one. I don't know for sure, but that sounds like something that could happen. Okay, this is good. All right. That should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. All right, buddy. Boy. Don't remember no mistakes. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. Uh, let's do shotgun there. Rifle. I'm not going to be using a bow for this one. Oh, wait, hold on. They want me to use... Oh, R1 switch... Oh, item wheel. Okay. Select clo... Oh, we got a bandit mask? Oh, shit. Now we're really an outlaw. Gentlemen, it's time. Good Thank life. you, Boo. All of you. You all know what to do. Great. Uh, shit, no, what? God! Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Where did you find that moron? You said it was fine. It was my fault. Come on! You're pathetic. You know that? Are we gonna run after the train? Well, we really are. Oh, God. All right. Well, there's one down. So much for that plan. Hey now, hey now, let's all... Wait, I thought I got my shotgun! No, well. Uh... Shouldn't we push up? Ah, uh, we should. Farewell, friend. Let's reload. Take cover. What the hell was Bill doing? 
He had long enough to set that car. Well, I hooked up the wire, but we won't mention that. <laughs> Look, it could be my fault, but let's not say that. That's what we're doing, kid. It is high noon, Darth. I'm going to try and kill them all. Wait, hold on. To climb over Should obstacles? Alright, whatever. No, 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 I didn't mean to actually pick it. Oh, God. Well. Come on, let's get to the front. I wonder if I can use them as, like, a I'm shield. We have to stop this train. Never mind. Bye-bye. We moving up? Oh, God. Yo, I got a loot back here, buddy. Look, I got a cigar. Jesus. Shoot him, damn it. I think I may have shot you, but that's fine. Oh, God. Behind. Look, they're coming out of that last car. We're gonna get out of this. Oh, I know we are. Hey, that's the other boy. Ah. Oh, you're ready to die. Woo! Oh, what? What? Whoop, whoops, whoops. Oh, that's the rest of the gang. Okay. No, 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 I messed up! Gosh darn it. Or maybe they're already dead. I can see now why the old Driscoll brought so many boys up here for this. Parker, get over here. I was trying to be cool and then I messed it up. Oh well. We killed them all, that's all that matters. All right. Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. Um. Is this gonna work? That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Now, it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems <laughs> good enough. Here we go. Now light the fuse. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. Oh, oh, don't mind if I do. All right, come on. Just walk on out here. <laughs> we don't want to kill you. My oh we just want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Look 
at this place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> What's your name? You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's keen. I'll give you that. Okay, let's see if we can get this open. Okay. Oh, don't mind if I do. I'll take some fine brandy. Hell yeah. And I will consume some of that fine brandy. Where is that? Snake oil. Open gin. Ah, gin. Gin's fine, I guess. Through the mask. No problem. See? That's how it's done. Shit. Just a pile of papers. Bonds? I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. <sighs> Give me those. Railroad contracts, invoices, blah, blah, blah. You got anything? Not really. Sugar imports from the Spanish West Indies? A lot of sugar? Some fancy new boat he's ordered from Europe? <laughs> I am not robbing another boat as long as I live. Have you checked all the drawers and cabinets? Ooh. No, this looks like something. Come on! Let's hurry this along, boys! Oh, hey, look at that fox! Hey, what up, fox? I think I got him! Nice. We're slippy at. Got... Come on! <clears throat> hmm, it won't let me take the cigar. Oh, well. Oh, I can't carry any more of it. Okay, got it. Yeah, 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 I'm coming. What did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, uh, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Yeah. Um. I mean, they gave up. If we're playing as a Han Solo, I don't think we killed them. Okay. Get on the train, quick! All of you. Any bright ideas? I kill all three. So behave. Come on, move. We won't tell a soul. I swear. Come on. Whoa, whoa. I hear so much as a footstep from this car. You'll end up like all your friends out here. Listen, we're not playing as Cassandra in Assassin's Creed. We decided to play this as Han Solo, so we're going to play it as Han Solo. There are so many bodies to loot. Maybe a slightly more evil Han Solo, but still a Han Solo. I'm trying to get him. There we go. Uh, hello, Kading. Welcome. God, there's so many things to loot, Jesus. Look at all these bodies. Do I mean Greedo then? Sure. But, you know, a Greedo that doesn't die.
Maybe closer to Han Solo's mentor. Good old Woody, ne Woody Nelson? Woody Harrelson. Not Woody Nelson, that's a different guy. Just like ride the train. You haven't seen the Han Solo movie, Yalu? It's okay. I, I'd watch it once. I don't know about twice. But definitely once. The droid was pretty cool, Liz, I agree. I don't know if I agree on the entire movie being so great, but it's not bad. We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. Well then, let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. I'm sure they'll be fine, Rose. Those people on the train, they'll figure it out. <laughs> they'll figure something out. Is this game good so far? I think so, Darth. I'm enjoying it. Han Solo was better than the prequels. Well, I mean, come on. Like, is that really hard to be better? That's not really a, a bar to set a movie against. My high school play was probably better than the damn prequels. That's a lie. That, that's, that's a big old lie, actually. Nice moment. So let's ruin Ready. oh Micah, get over here. Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me with the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. Hello, Wolfwiz. Yep, we're playing Oregon Trail, Cherry. Exactly. Half this crew's gonna die of dysentery. We're gonna go out there, hunt about a hundred buffalo, take back maybe one. Oh god, we have a wagon? Yeah. Alright. Maybe this is Oregon Trail. Okay. Let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on. Oh, God. Ooh. Still strong enough to hold up <laughs> What Say, is this game? Just saying. Well, say less. Pick the wheel up. Nearly there. there. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. Oh, no. Oh. 
Not very stealthy. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Was that man's red, like, really... Or, sorry, was that man's nose really red? Not too far now. Like Rudolph? Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. So... Oh, interesting. Okay. I'm just turn it off. Huh. All right. Yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stole them clean away from them. It was every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly, uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of Dutch's talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated. Oh, that's pretty cool, Rose. Block-headed driver here. So we can turn off the compass and people will tell us where to go? Hey, Alright, let me see. Don't blame it on me. Never forget. This here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just cause it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. Yeah. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did. When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. We're too hot? He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13. The hell? I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. I like it a lot, Big Jojo. Also, welcome to the stream. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. <gasps> Look at those older guys shooting him out of here. Yeah, we still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we plan? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. The Driscolls? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, oh. maybe it's me who's changed, not him. But we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... Well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. It's gonna be hard to do cinematic camera and, you know, radar off that. Working on there, anyway. Just some Yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay, thank you. Yeah.
I have not lost my hat yet, Cryptic. Okay. Just making sure we're still going the right way. <laughs> my love of the cinematic camera may have to... There you are, brother. Kind of take a back seat here. Okay, let's go. Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Whoa, 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 whoa. So, gentlemen, we have survived. Yeah, we have. And now, now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck, east of the Grizzlies and out of money, and a, a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother, but we are safe. We make a bit of money here, then we move again, head out around them, be west of Uncle Sam, in a few months, buy some land. I hope so. <laughs> Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. It is very pretty, I guess. Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. <laughs> Everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough. But we are safe now, and we are far too poor. Agreed. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Oh, that's our cover Uncle, story, huh? Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. Can we put you over here? Okay. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. Damn. I like her. We can shave? Sleep here? Okay. Now, should we? I, I know over time we can have our hair grow very, very, very long. Should we just let it grow long? I'm kind of tempted to see how long it gets. We just look like a, a mountain man at some point. Oh, crap. Did I miss your resub, buddy? I'm sorry. I think I did. From 16 minutes ago. I'm sorry. Thank you for the resub. Road east in December. Pretty enough country called the Heartland. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. 
His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier, in spite of black water and that whole mess. Chad agrees we should just leave the hair to grow. Okay. All right. Jose. <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> All right.